Alrighty, people, you know one of the best things about a cold or a rainy wintery night. And you got the old fireplace fired up there trying to stay warm. And you want to remember back in the summer when you was out cooking out, camping out. You know one of the best things about going camping and stuff is roasting hot dogs on the open fire, right? Well, who says you can't have that same feeling in the winter time? <laughs> Well, it's kind of a prepping move here, I'd say. Heating your house and cooking your supper. And just sitting back, you know, having a good old time. <laughs> What's the matter, Miss Lazy May? Are you practicing for bug out? <laughs> Oh, I know how to bug out if I need to bug out, do you? <laughs> yep, all are you. If all me, huh? Yep. <laughs> that might get you in trouble. Look like after 40 years you'd learn not to follow me. <laughs> nope, it's become a habit. I hear you. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, you know, people talks about all this different stuff, about prepping and everything, but you know, you got to be able to figure out a way of warming your food up or cooking it or whatever, you know. Having some, and you it know, burnt weenies. And, you know, it, it ain't rocket science. That's, I mean, you know, they've done it for thousands of years before they come up with all these modern uh, products. After they invented fire. Uh huh. You know, back in the day that that was first invented, that was probably scared a lot of people too, thinking that, you know, what's going to be next. Or how bad is this for us? <laughs> I mean, you know, really and truly, I mean, you know, just, it'd be really hard to imagine what them people was thinking. Ain't nothing better than a good old roasted weenie on an open fire. Y'all see that? Ooh, there's her two on the end that's burnt. And then mine too back here on the other end. But y'all, I just thought I would try to put a little something together there for you. While we getting ready to eat a bite. Yeah, and one thing good about cleaning up after prepping cooking is you just throw another log on the fire. Or two if they run. <laughs> yum, yum, I done eat me some. Oh. Yeah, I done had to turn the camera off and go eat. I couldn't, I couldn't wait on them, you know. And, it was so good. I didn't I didn't get the opportunity to do a taste test on mine, so y'all, I'm sorry. <laughs> you wanna see the taste test, I guess you'll have to go over to the Lazy Maze Country Kitchen and watch it over there. Because the taste know. test got put over there. You know, as you know, we love them anyway. Uh, yep. So y'all, I just, I know I had not put nothing out in a day or two, so I thought I'd try to get a little something that's been 
Today it's been cold the last few days, and today it's just been cold and rain and rain, and I just the only thing is after I got back, we got back in this seat and everything. The only thing I could think of to do was the the, the do the cooking. So that's what I done. So that's what y'all get to watch. Hope you enjoy it. So. We love you guys and hope y'all eat as good as we did tonight. Uh, yep. So y'all hit them buttons, like, subscribe, share us out. Because you know what they say, if you don't do that, YouTube don't recommend you. <laughs> exactly. So, y'all have a great one and we'll catch you on the next one. Bye. Bye.